Well, a place that's been in business for a quarter century will soon close. Its longtime owner says uh, they're ready to retire. Yeah, it's a big deal. And right now, there is no plans to keep his restaurant open. Jordan Johnson spoke with the owner and some of his customers about this bittersweet milestone. On a Wednesday afternoon, Gordy Harper's Bazaar is busy with families and friends looking for a bite to eat. But come January, this local landmark will close for good after 25 years. It's, it's breaking my heart. It is, this is, uh, it's like a, it's like we're losing a national treasure, really. This man that runs this place is fantastic. He's always done really good things for each community. And it's not just the customers who are feeling the loss. Vendors of the bazaar tell me they are devastated. So what does that mean now, once they close in January? I'm going to be done. <laughs> we have 15 days to get our stuff out of here after January 1st. How many items do you have? Oh, probably 10,000 items in there. At the sprite age of 88, Gordon Harper is hanging up his apron, busser's cloth, and baker's hat to enjoy retirement. I know a lot of people love coming here. I feel bad that I have to close down. I also feel it necessary that, that I am chilling down. It was the customers, visitors, and workers that Gordon says have made the journey so worthwhile. I'd really like to thank the people in Western New York and the Buffalo and Niagara Falls area and around Niagara County for supporting me through the 25 years I've been here. Gordy Harper's Bazaar is open for lunch and dinner until the new year. Jordan Johnson, 7 News, New Fame.